Hello everyone, Dominic here, back with some news for you. This was something I saw announced a couple of days ago by London Spitfire that I thought was pretty interesting. They've announced a, a, a flight school, which is sort of like an online boot camp, helping people improve at the game, but also get to know their team. Coaches, some management, pro players. Let's jump into this, because I think this is this is pretty interesting, and I think it's something that other orgs might do in the future. So they've announced that it's returning later this month. It's taking place from February 15th to 19th, and it's purely online. It's going to be on Discord, and it will give gamers, it says here, the opportunity to participate in a structured online curriculum featuring members of the Spitfire team. I don't think that's... A, <laughs> I mean, they're calling it a flight school, but it's 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 gaming related, isn't it? And we'll we'll come on to that. You'll see that so training will take place from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. GMT each day, and will include match and macro reviews, esports seminars, guest talks, and tournament play. And it's it's designed to provide gamers with various skills to improve their gaming abilities and other aspects of their lives. It says including teamwork, communication, and staying calm under pressure. And this deal has come about as part of a partnership with Nerd Street Gamers, they're a US-based esports events provider, and it looks like it's been struck by Guinevere Capital. Now, Guinevere Capital are one of XL Esports shareholders, obviously a separate org. London Spitfire is owned by Cloud9, of course, but you can see last year a deal was struck between Guinevere Capital and Cloud9 to increase London Spitfire's connection to the UK and Europe, this was announced last summer and basically it was announced that Guinevere Capital would be focusing on commercial opportunities and ensuring the success of live homestand events in 2021. So yeah, you can see this deal has been put in place and it is commercial as well because it does cost money to attend the camp. It's £99 per person to attend flight school or £149 for a plus ticket. That also includes a Spitfire home jersey, cap, socks, pop socket, tote bag and lanyard. So a bunch of merch there as well. So, you know, it does cost money, um, but it is for four days. And I think 10 till 3 p.m. each day. I think that's a substantial amount of time there. And it's not just, you know, presentations. It's not your usual spiel. You're getting access to the players, the coaches, you know, actual pro players, people on the team. I think there's value in that. I think for the money, really, you know, some people might turn their nose up and say, Don, what are you talking about? This is too expensive. But I actually think here, this it's not too bad. Um, obviously, it's, it is expensive, you know, £100 to £150 if you want to buy the merch. If you're a big fan and you have that money to spend, I think that's pretty decent if you don't have that money to spend you know you can still follow spitfire you can still follow other teams obviously watch on twitch and so on and show your support that way but as an extra bit of value i think it's pretty cool and what i like about it as well is that i think other orgs could learn from this in the future semi-pro teams as well why don't you get why don't you engage with your fans and do little um discord gatherings i know i'm sure a lot do Discord watch parties, you know, the XL Esports Discord is pretty well run and they do little watch part viewing parties for the LEC and things like that. But I like the idea of this esports camp. I like the idea that it's actually engaging with the community more than just, you know, subscribe, follow us, here's what we're doing, come and watch. And it's almost like a bit of a passive relationship. I like this idea of really engaging with the community and I'd like to see more orgs do this in the future both at the pro and semi-pro and lower level, I suppose. Um, so just to end then, let's have a quick look at the actual page, the sign-up page on the Nerd Street Gamers website. You can see here, yeah, some of the merch I've mentioned and the hours and the times. And you can see here who's going to be attending, Manager Nuki, you've got Coaches, Hybrid and Commander X, and you've got actual players, Molf, Hadi Kellex, um, uh, sorry, coaches are Commander X and Riprise, um, the others are, are players, and then you've got um, Nuki as manager. So, yeah, you know, obvious stuff you need to have watched, downloaded, and installed on your PC. Other bits and pieces, it's for people aged 13 and over. Um, two ticket types one for 13 to 17, and one for 18 plus. 
so yeah i i think it's pretty interesting this flight school i like what they're doing and i'd like to see more of this in esports um let me know what you think do you think flight school is a good idea is it too expensive do you think other orgs can do similar things to this uh, it'd be interesting to hear your thoughts um, so that's it from me. That's my quick news update for today, February 2nd. Hope you're enjoying all the content I'm putting out. I'm still getting used to doing Esports News UK full time, going from like one article a day to a good handful at the moment. But it um, be interesting to see as the months progress uh, what I'm able to do and where we go from here. Thank you for watching and joining me on this journey. And I'll catch you next time.